back to another Cuboids video. Today I will be showing you how to get the yellow cross on the 3x3 Rubik's Cube. Please do not watch, watch this video unless you have seen my other videos and you have the complete first two layers done. We will only need one algorithm for this and it is a very simple one to learn. Let's get right into it. Let's start out by showing you the different possibilities that you may have. So starting out, we want to make sure that we are only focusing on the cross. These corner pieces do not matter what color they have facing up on the yellow side. There are only three possibilities for what it can be. Obviously, there's just one with the yellow centerpiece, and it is just a dot. And again, compared to the cross, not the whole section. Another possibility is that there is a yellow line or cross. The last possibility is that there is a little um, kind of like half a cross. I call it like a check almost. Let's start out by saying what it would be like if there's only a check here. So you want to start by making sure that it is oriented in the top left corner and that you are facing whatever color you want with this in the top left and you want to do this algorithm which will be right there F U R U counterclockwise R counterclockwise F counterclockwise and you can see there will be the cross if there was just a bar, you want to do this algorithm. F, R, U, R counterclockwise, U counterclockwise, and then F counterclockwise. And again, you will have the cross. If there's just the um, white center in here, you want to combine both of those, and you can do it in either order. I like to do the algorithm F, U, R, U counterclockwise, R counterclockwise, F counterclockwise, and you can see you will have a bar. You want to correct that by making it horizontal or not or parallel to you, and you want to do F, R, U, R counterclockwise, U counterclockwise, F counterclockwise. Thanks for watching. Please comment, like, and subscribe, and remember, keep cubing.